Bill and Glenda, an arrest was made, and the group that had that was arrested, uh, they were here on Friday. We had to actually meet them at least four miles away from the festival because they were kicked out and told if they came back that they would all be arrested. Now, that fight was captured on video, and we're going to show that to you right now. You're looking at footage of an angry mob of people throwing punches at the Bible Believers group who are out there to protest. Now, the video comes from two cameras that they had out there, the protesters. Their organizer, Ruben Israel, tells us that everything was calm for about two hours, and then three to four young men started punching a man in their group. Now, the fight amassed to a larger, massive group, and then one of the protesters was arrested. You can see him being led away in the handcuffs, and organizers say police told them he was arrested for starting a riot and kicked out the rest of the group, threatening them with arrest, like I said, if they didn't leave. Now, that group had been here on Friday, and barricades were around them at that time, but this time, they didn't have those barricades, and they were waving signs around that said, Islam is a religion of blood and murder. So, organizer Ruben Israel says that he believes Dearborn doesn't understand freedom of speech, and that's why they were here. When we go back and report what happened uh, next year, there could be a hundred of us out here. Uh, you, 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 you don't allow these guys to pass out tracks, and then you arrest one of our guys. Uh, I don't know if they know what they're doing. Now, the group didn't have a permit, and they don't need one as long as they were on the sidewalk and in that free speech zone. But again, uh, the two sides got together. They're mixed up, which is the festival goers and the protesters. So that's why that fight started. We're still waiting here from the Wayne County Sheriff's Department on whether or not anyone else was arrested. So far, we don't believe there was. We believe their group had the only arrest. For now, we're live in Dearborn. Julie Bonovich, Channel 7 Action News.